Okay, what's up everybody? Here's another water comparison video. Tonight we have four sparkling flavored waters from Dasani. And as you can see, they look identical except for the different flavors. So first up we have raspberry lemonade, then tropical pineapple, and then berry and black cherry. So I really don't have much to say about these. Let's just open them up and start doing a comparison. At the end of the video, I'll decide which one I personally think is best and it's going to move on to the next round. So here we go. Tropical pineapple. I do smell pineapple. I think with the, the carbonated sparkling waters, more gas is released from the can. And I think that just helps you smell um, the, the flavor more. I've done waters that are just flavored and are not carbonated, and they don't have as much of a smell to them. <coughs> so here we go. Yeah, the taste is not as <laughs> strong of a, of a pineapple as um, the smell is. It's kind of interesting. And here we go. The next one is raspberry lemonade. Yeah, the raspberry is um, a lot stronger than the, the lemonade, that's for sure. So about a week ago, I did a review of all the Aquafina bottles. And I was saying, like, why are they making it in this shape of a can? I'm like, why are they not using the standard sized can for, for their sparkling waters? And then the more I've been doing these reviews, the more I realize... Every company is doing this size can for, for their sparkling waters for some reason. Um, maybe they're copying like Red Bull or something, but LaCroix was doing the same size can. The company BAI, the, the bottled um, sparkling water company, is doing this same shape of water for some reason. It's kind of interesting. These cans are very similar. Really, the only thing different about Aquafina that stuck out was Aquafina has colors indicating what flavor they are on the, the cap. I think that's a nice touch from Aquafina. Dasani does not do that on theirs. Okay, here's the next one. Black Cherry. Black Cherry is what won for Aquafina. So let's see if it happens with this. You can smell... Some, uh, smells like cherry. Yeah. Tastes like cherry. Um, the back of the can says 0% juice. So this is just all... It's all artificial stuff in here. If you look at the nutritional info... It has zero for everything, zero calories, zero carbs, zero fat. But it does have 35 milligrams of sodium. So that's 1% of your daily sodium recommendations. Water shouldn't have any sodium. So that's a big, you know, any any sodium in water is a big, big thumbs down from me. <coughs> Excuse me. Now finally we have berry. I don't know. This is, a, this is also a weird one. Like, it's called berry, but what kind of berry is it? Like, you know, it's not strawberry. It's not, like, is it, is it blueberry, raspberry? Who knows? Just berry. Kind of the most vague out of all of them. And so, the berry I bought from Amazon... The berry was $3.18 on Amazon, plus it was Prime Pantry, so I had to pay $5.99 for shipping. So that's more expensive than the other three. The other three were from Target, 
and they were two dollars and ninety nine cents. So if you want to buy these, get them at Target. It's a little bit cheaper. So these are four of the flavors. Uh, there are two others I didn't get my hands on. There's also lemon and lime as two separate flavors. <laughs> Excuse me. They just didn't have it at the, the Target, so I didn't get them. Let's try pineapple again. Tastes the same as the first time I drank it. So if there's a smell, here's an interesting thing. What happens if I smell them all at once? I don't know. It just smells like a bunch of fruit. Nothing interesting there. <sighs> I don't like sparkling waters. So, this review is, is a little bit biased. I much prefer still waters. So, these were all sold in these boxes, in, the, in these eight packs. That's how much the price was. It's um, about $3 for an eight pack. And so, after I do these reviews of Sparkling Waters, I'm always left with the rest of the box. And um, so I've been doing a lot of Sparkling Water reviews the past few weeks, and I'm getting left over with all the extra, extra cans. And so, I, so I've just been drinking a lot of sparkling waters, even when I'm not making videos. And um, anyway, what I've noticed is these are significantly better when refrigerated. Um, that's what I've learned while not making videos. And right now these are not refrigerated. But I bet these would taste better if they were refrigerated. Just um, something I've noticed. Let's try pineapple again. <laughs> Excuse me. I think I already know what the winner is, but let's, um, let me just try to finish these up. This one kind of has like a, kind of tastes like a floor cleaner a little bit. I think it's the, the lemonade. It sort of tastes the way that pine saw smells. So Dasani is owned by Coca-Cola. Aquafina is owned by Pepsi. That's why I keep bringing up Aquafina, because they're um, sort of in direct competition with each other. And I think it's pretty pretty obvious that, you know, they're sort of copying each other in, in their style. Because it just looks, you know, so similar to cans. And that's that. Yeah, I'm, I'm out of stuff to say about these. I'm just going to keep drinking them. I was watching some YouTube videos of people reviewing these. And people mostly have negative stuff to say about them. There was actually one video of um, two black people. looks like a father and a son. And um, <laughs> they had a video, I think it was called the Dasani Sparkling Water Challenge. <laughs> and the, the whole challenge is to just drink, just to drink this. That's their challenge. I thought that was funny. 
<coughs> excuse me. Like this is supposed to be sold as something that people enjoy and people want to consume. <coughs> excuse me. This gas is making me burp a lot. But then that YouTube video, they considered it a challenge just to drink it. This is done. Tropical pineapple is done. Three to go. Berry is done. Lemonade is done. So I'm going to say that Lemonade and Berry, I'm going to say these both tie for last place out of the four. I think these are equally bad. And so those two are out. So we're left with Black Cherry and Tropical Pineapple. And keep in mind, this is just my personal preference on which is better. You know, if you tasted these, you might have the complete opposite opinion. kind of funny I just had this like like sort of look of pain on my face as I'm drinking this and I'm actually going to call this one the winner too um out of the four yeah I would say I just prefer the black cherry it just I guess just my personal my personal opinion and that's what one with the uh the aquafina aquafina was black cherry dragon fruit so, in round two, we're going to have these two competing against each other to see which one is the best. Okay, so these four are done. And this channel is called John Drinks Water. In every episode, I drink a bottle of water. But it's kind of debatable whether these are actually water. They call themselves water. <laughs> but... Since they're carbonated, and they have flavor, and they have the sodium, I'm not really sure. And I want to make this episode official, so I'm going to drink a real bottle of water. Alright, thanks for watching everyone. Congratulations, Black Cherry.